All right, guys, you see what's up. I'm hopping straight into it. No intro, no nothing. We got to talk about this. Now, we got an in-depth look more into Street Fighter Six. Yes, we got gameplay a little bit into the story mode and everything, and I just want to go through right quick the things that I saw, the things that I like, the things I love. One thing I kind of didn't like that I saw, uh, but that's really not that bad. But, man, we, we got to talk about this real quick. So, one of the first things that I saw that I really, really loved was the hip hop theme? The theme, the hip hop themes coming back. That's fantastic. I love that. It really gives a great energy to the game. I could also tell with this game, it seems like they're trying to go for a more modern, new age feel. It really seems like they're trying to get newer generations or newer people in the Street Fighter, and it works really well. It looks really good, man. This is. I'm not gonna lie. This is fantastic. So I'm. I'm pretty pretty hyped to talk about this, but um. So, yes, another thing that I wanted to say, it looks like Luke is in a metro city, his own version of, like, New York City. So, it gives, like, that, you know, at the same time, gritty feel. While at the same time, it did look like, you know, there was some type of underground fight club going on that Ryu and Chun Li were a part of that they're coming to Luke, Luke City. And maybe they, uh, that newer guy, we're going to see him in the background soon. But uh, I, I didn't, I forget his name right quick, but they look like him and Luke were friends and stuff like that. And they were fighting. But that's looking pretty, pretty cool. So uh, being in a big city and stuff like that, that definitely does help with that newer generation feel and stuff. So that's pretty cool. It looks like we also saw Ab Abigail up in here. You saw the guy with the the uh, the jacket on with the dreads in the back and the stuff like that. I don't know if it's like a slimmer version of him. He, he didn't look that big to be Abigail, but it looks like he works for the same people. Um, so... Uh, it looks like we also have a free world story mode. You know, you saw in here, it looks like Luke was walking around and running through the city and stuff like that. So that looks like that's pretty cool. Um, that's definitely something new to Street Fighter. You know, when it comes to story modes and stuff like that, fighting games, that's not one thing that they're used to coming from arcades and stuff like that. That's just not something that they're used to doing, having story modes like that. So that's fantastic. Um... The game looks amazing overall. I mean, you seeing it like the art style and stuff like that. Uh, it looks it reminds me a lot of Street Fighter Six. I mean, it really does. It looks fantastic. You know, it looks like the focus attacks and things like that from Street Fighter Four, but they brought it back with a lot more colors and flair and stuff like that, which really helps with you know, like I said, that newer age feel and everything like that. Now, there's like a little jerk that Ryu did when he was like. Uh, powering up that looked kind of weird to me. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna I would probably pre replay it right now so you guys can know exactly what I'm talking about. But that little jiggle jerk he did now that looked kind of weird. That's probably the only flaw that I would say. Well, thing that I would point out from the whole tournament, I mean, from the whole uh, from the whole trailer, I wouldn't say it's a flaw, but just something I saw. I was like, that's kind of weird. So I take back the word flaw. But another thing is coming to Xbox Series X. So we're going back to Xbox. So we probably don't have to be stuck with the PS5 now. It's also coming to PS4 also, but we've been seeing lately there's issues with delays and stuff like that when it comes to the PS5. But with it going to Xbox Series X, there's a chance that it could run better on a newer generation type system. And as you see, this is where he's running around and stuff like that. But, uh, yes, so we don't have to worry. We have more options when it comes to what system we're playing the game on going into the future. If PlayStation doesn't seem like they're going to fix all these different things that they have going on. But, yes, this game looks fantastic, man. I'm pretty hyped. I wanted to just get this out really, really quickly because I'm kind of doing stuff right now. But, you know, when it comes to the FGC, we got to do it. We got to put it on for you guys. So, but, yes, this game is looking fantastic. I mean, I'm definitely hyped. I love the energy. I love the feel. I love the hype. I mean, it's working well with everything it seems like they're trying to do right now. I mean, nothing really stood out as bad. Everything is looking fantastic. Now, you know, there's, there's going to be people that have, like, it's, it's, you know, there are things about it that they probably won't necessarily like. But, I mean, I think at the end of the day, this is really not, you could just say this is a net positive. At the end of the day, this is a net positive. Everything that they have going on, this trailer looks fantastic, so. I mean, a lot of people were kind of like, you know, worried about Luke and stuff like that going into the future. But the way they presented it and stuff like that and this new direction that they're going into, we know Street Fighter does this every time with every new game that they have come out. They kind of go in a new direction, new feel and stuff like that. And this is looking pretty dope. Now, as far as like competitive play and stuff like that, I mean, we're going to that's that's 
actually having to get your hands on the game or they're going to have to give like in-depth details of people actually fighting you know when it comes to like competitive play and how the game feels and all that other stuff so we have to wait a little bit more for that but i mean so far fantastic looks great i mean you guys tell me what y'all think do y'all like it i mean it looks fantastic i mean i got to run it here in the back and it looks amazing to me uh the logo looks a little bit better <laughs> you know what they what they did the little um uh, you know crushed earth magma looking type deal with it so that looks better but yeah you guys let me know what you think comment down below this is your boy i just had to get this out real quick uh catch you next time